dollars for my car, for my bike, for everything. Just a few more dollars, dollars. Welcome to the episode and see if Vinny the VF1000 gets going or not. We gotta get it going somehow. <laughs> Skip here on the VF1000, you know, just getting things done after returning. Hopefully uh, run it and complete it all this week. I've got to buy a little bit of petrol and uh, the, the battery's on trickle charge. Just fixing a few things up like this airbox. Remember I said you can't buy a clip, see that it falls out. So what I did is got these polymer or I don't know what they call that um, foam just to hold it in just so we get it up and running. This is the throttle grip underneath and I'm going to blow a grip on. I'll show you how to blow a grip on. Here we go. Right, this is the same grip as that side. That's why I wanted to use it. And this is made by Honda. Right, I painted the end bit probably an hour and a half ago. I just wanted to have that nice touch. Hey? All right, so you go, Ace. Now, as you can see, it's working a treat. <laughs> All right, so it started. Once you get it, oh, there you go. Oh, there you go. Technique, technique. Here you go. I keeps getting stuck under it, that's why. Oh, scratch all me paint off. There we go, there it is. So yesterday I put the brakes on, the front side brakes, remember them? <laughs> so here they are. And what we got, a, this is called an anti-dive system. You adjust it here and it's got a floating carrier and they were all in superb condition. I've got braided lines. You know what braided lines are, boys and girls? They're braided, so the outside of the hose is in stainless steel. So when a hose swells, you, you get sponginess on your brakes. So in racing, they use braided, braided lines, so you don't get any sponging. So here we have, so that's the other one. That's the other one. Got the bad boy on it and working. Now here, and now we've got brakes. Clutch, clutch and brakes. So tomorrow, hopefully, we're gonna turn it over. Turn it over, I can't do it now, because it, oh, battery's on trickle charge, as I said. A Little bit of uh, petroleum, petroleum, and then it's looking good. So I don't know the condition of the starter motor, don't know the condition of the engine. Um, just gotta make sure there's oil in it and oil and then uh, don't hook your petrol up just yet and let it spin over so you get oil pressure and we're gonna get it done one job at a time we're gonna get a little bit of a dance move there uh, you know it's a it's a one-off so uh watch this space just in case i we're gonna get it done we're gonna get it done yeah, 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 we're gonna get it done. Me and my boy, me and my boy. <laughs> okay, that's what a relay does when it doesn't work. Yeah, that's it, see? See, probably the starter motor needs refurbishing. See? Hopefully it'll still do it. Just tried uh, Vinny, and he's spinning over ever so slow. Uh, had the jump pack and the, char uh, the battery on it, and it seems like um, a starter motor, pretty no good. So I'm going to buy a new starter motor and a solenoid for it. Solenoid is separate; they're not on the starter motor. They put them at the back. So um, 
and apparently there's 750 and they spin over really quick. <laughs> First person to buy me a coffee was my wife. Buy me a coffee. First one. So happy. You don't have to let money come. He's, he's Vinny. He's just waiting for um, starter motor and a relay. I've got fuel in the tank. In the car rears. The battery's okay. So it's ready to go. You've got to wait for those parts and then a rear master cylinder from Francais, Skippy here, and um, I've just gotten the mail on my spark plug spanners and now putting uh, the rear master cylinder, assembling that, I've decided to buy a new starter motor and new relay because they're both just clicking and you have to hit the starter motor to get it run so that's, it's not good is it, so here it is here. So that's the um, rear master cylinder, gets pumped by the pedal, there's the action, um, there's the clevis, uh, clevis pin we call it, um, action pin, cylinder, and it goes to the reservoir, so that, and that gets all bolted in there, it's all, you know, all designed to fit, so, uh, and there's that one there. Uh, oh yeah, I'll show you this. They supplied this. This is from the Francais boys. All, all different companies, of course, on eBay. So this is what we call a banjo bolt. So then it's got a hole from the side. All right, and you have two seals, that one and that one, either side. Come on, Vinny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Come on, yeah, 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 yeah. Just got a delivery. I said I was, uh, I'll put the rear master cylinder in and Vinny the VF1000. Um, I'm getting very close to the, uh, finishing that. I started to move it out and I'm gonna work on Bonnie the Beetle soon. Uh, <laughs> so that's how we do things. And so I just, I ordered a, a starter motor. A solenoid relay which doesn't sit on the starter motor, it sits near the battery. And so I've decided I'll buy a fuel pump as well because it has the right uh, electrical plug connection. And I might have to buy a few fuses and that should about do it. I'm still waiting for the relay. So um, here's what I just received in the mail. Made by Arrowhead, I believe it, it may have been a good like English company years ago, but now it's um, um, well made in China, but looks like good quality. Uh, I've heard the reports from uh, on the forums to say they're okay. Now this is a 751. I don't think you can buy a thousand. I just have to slice it there. Now there is a difference, but they say it does fit. And that is your electrical terminal. That's all you have. See, the solenoid's not on here. A lot of Volkswagens and cars, you have a solenoid on top and it just clicks because there's a lot of power going through here. And this will spin your engine. Let's see if it turns. Hmm. It's a bit different. And so the V1000, has the terminal here. So you have to stretch the cable, you have to reroute the cable to get it on here. I put on the rear master cylinder, I have rear brakes. Fuel pump, I want to put a new fuel pump on. I couldn't get the thing to tick over. Uh, just uh, changing the starter motor. Relay hasn't come, we'll wait for that. 
but this is how easy the starter motor gets changed. I have to disconnect the battery first, then up under here, three volts. Then this one in. Battery's disconnected. Let's go. Let's go get it. Vinny is getting so close. I'm just waiting for one more bit. Uh, two pieces come today, starter motor and relay. I haven't put the relay on, but I put the starter motor on. We're on the Vinner, mate. Vinner. So I installed it in here today. And of course it goes in uh, underneath. Yeah. I wanted to pull a spark plug out and I bought a set of spark plug spanners. Here it is there. But I think it's 18 and the biggest is 17. What a doozy. <laughs> oh, one more thing, fuel pump and that's it. Fuel pump's not expensive. I think delivered 18 pounds, brand new one. And it's got the proper plug. And, and that one there stripped and it's got tape all on it. Oh, I don't know what it is. It doesn't work anyway, so. And then I can just throw all this back together. But the reason why I've got the fairings off is because this is the radiator. Once you start it and you run it for quite a while, there's a couple of bleed screws in the engine. And then you keep filling it, bleeding it, bleeding it until it's full and that's it. Then you seal it up and you put the fairing back on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, onwards and upwards. Yeah, 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 onwards. Subscribe to the channel, folks. I'll be really happy about that one. I haven't got the front fairing on because this is where you fill the radiator and there's no coolant or water in the engine. It's the first time I'm gonna run it. We just see if it fires. Give it a go now, huh? Do me proud. Thanks for hanging around, it was well worth it, wasn't it? Hey, what a great machine. You don't have to let